Yo, lately I haven't been getting into my sneaker bag, as you could say. I haven't had any interest in really buying sneakers like that. And my last one was like the I'm on my year ones that y'all seen last year. Just simply because one, I'm more so concerned about my wardrobe, building my wardrobe. And two, at this rate, the sneaker game is really boring me. So with that being said, let's talk about my top reasons why I'm really fading off when it comes to this sneaker game. Let's go. What's good, camp crew? It's your homeboy, Camp Quarter Banks, and welcome back to the channel. Now, today we're talking about my top five reasons why I'm just losing interest in sneakers as of right now. Don't get me wrong, I still love my sneakers. I still love finding some dope pieces, but at this rate that we're going right now, I'm just losing interest. So let's just kick it off real quick with number one. Now, number one is how many ways can you reinvent the same sneaker? At this point, I've seen so many Jordan 1s that it doesn't make any sense. Every year, I could guarantee there is gonna be a Jordan 1 that drop every year. And the only thing that people like right now is collabs. They don't even like the basics. Now, we'll talk about the basics later on. It's gonna be crazy. We'll talk about the basics later on. But right now, like I said, every year a Jordan 1 is gonna drop. You can guarantee that some Nike Dunks is gonna drop. And you just keep recycling this same wheel. How many times can you recreate the original before it just goes out of style completely? At this point, I'm bored of it. Simple as that. All right, now number two is everybody want the new sneaker. Of course everybody want the new sneaker. You're gonna go for the same sneaker that's new. Every year you're gonna go for a newer sneaker. But at the same time, I feel like people are forgetting about the old sneakers that they have that's fire. Once they wear them once or twice or the hype has gone down, People want to go for the next sneaker instead of having the pieces that they have right now and styling it in multiple ways. So people would rather have some dope sneakers, the fire sneakers, get them on their feet and have everything else up top just look like blah. And it's boring to me. So at this point, I don't even care for like the new sneakers. At this point, I'd rather go back in the vault, find some sneakers that people haven't been wearing, buy those, and instead of buying some new sneakers and still be fired with the pieces that I got from back then. I don't know about y'all, but that's just me. All right, now number three is faking the funk. Like I understand fake it until you make it, but at this point, IG got people going crazy. Social media just have people minds going crazy. People will rather buy some fire sneakers that just came out, put their stinking feet on the inside, take them out just so they could get a picture on IG, take their feet out of it, and then try to sell it for three times the price, man. Y'all out here going crazy. I'm losing the love for sneakers. Like, I'd rather respect somebody who actually got some fire pieces on their feet and wear them around until they get their wear on them and everything. But instead, y'all rather just take a picture in them real quick just to say y'all got them so y'all can get a bunch of likes and then go send it off to somebody else and boost the price for like three times this price. Come on, dog. Y'all sick with it. I ain't with it. Number four. Number four is people are just thinking that the sneaker game is just Jordans and Yeezys. Jordans and Yeezys, Jordans and Yeezys. I'm so tired, I'm so exhausted at this point that I just don't wanna hear about them too. Not really, I really don't care for them because I already seen them, I already seen how many times people can switch it up. And at this point, everybody that talk about Yeezys, if I hear another person go crazy about these sneakers, like, oh my God, Yeezy just went up two color shades, like, it ain't that deep for y'all to be going crazy over a Yeezy. Like, how many ways can this man do the same sneaker, don't change nothing, just give you a new shade, and it's probably like a shade lighter or a shade darker called rust, sand, rock, clay. Think of all these earth tones, and then after that, give it to y'all, and y'all go nuts for it. I'm sorry. And it's the same thing with Jordan 1s at this point. It's like, dog. I don't wanna see a Jordan 1 for about a year or two. I keep it a buck, that'll, that'll probably bring some excitement back to me. But at this point, the way that the people are right now with the sneaker game Jordans and Yeezys is just boring. I'd rather look at different sneakers. I'd rather see some more dope sneakers like Asics, New Balance, Reeboks, Adidas, something. Give me something new. I want some fire pieces from these different sneaker brands. Bring back the heat. I'm, I'm blown with this, I'm, it's boring. And lastly is that these basic sneakers get overhyped for nothing. I mean, they get overhyped and then they get oversold and they are the most basic of basic. When it has no real relevance to being a fire sneaker, it just be really basic. Perfect example, the dunks. You will put out some regular dunks on sneaker app, let it sell out. And once they sell out, they sell them for like three, four hundred dollars, but they be the most basic of basic. And what I mean is basic as in two tone color sneakers, gym red and white. They sell out, they sell them for three, four hundred dollars. Passion pink and white. They sell out, 
sell for three, four hundred dollars. But if you was to put those in a mall, nobody is gonna care for them. I'm pretty sure people will just bypass them. And if they do get bought, it'll just be all oh, some rinky dink sneakers to them. Nobody will really care for them like that and it won't get hyped up. So people are really buying because of how hype it is and not just buying because it's an actual sneaker that they like. They just buying it because it's a dump. Boring, bro. I'm over it. I'm over it. All right, y'all. Now that y'all done heard me rant and rave about all these sneakers and everything and why I don't really like this sneaker game right now, why I'm actually losing love for the sneaker game, let's keep it a buck. Let's keep it straightforward. It does not mean I don't love my sneakers that I have. It doesn't mean that I don't love sneakers that will be coming out in the future. It's just right now, I'm just really not interested in what's going on with the sneaker game. I'm just really not interested. I'm not really having as much fun as I used to have. It's kind of boring to me, but that's not going to stop me from buying buying sneakers for myself, my daughter, and my fiance, but at the same time, I just had to rant a little bit, let out a little bit of steam, a little bit of heat. Now, if y'all feel me, drop that comment down below. Drop a thumbs up if y'all really digging this video, man. Vibe with me, man. Thank y'all for watching this video. As always, I appreciate y'all tuning in with me. I'm gonna catch up with y'all next time. I'm your homeboy, Cam Quarter Banks. Don't forget to hit that like button. I'm out, I'm gone. I'll holler at y'all. Peace.